Hi, Bruce from Safari, and what we're looking at here is a VW Crafter being built uh, in the other side of the world. We are building a dual voltage 110 to 30 volt power pack to go in here, working with the architect and the customer, and the requirement is to have completely clean lines, the whole power pack to be hidden. It's fitted with Safari's integrated display and digital control, and the requirement is the tablet to control it is not placed on the wall, but all done by the hand from wherever you are sitting. So it gives you a complete clean finish. This is very detailed work. We use a collaborative framework. All our projects on a electronic whiteboard and participating into this whiteboard is the interior designer, the customer and the Safari team. There's always numerous variations to the design and when it's finalized, then it proceeds through to the build phase. Let's have a look at the build. This is for a VW Crafter and it's being exported to Taiwan and uh, we have the full garment in there. It'll have a 10 inch screen when it ships. And this board here is a control board, which is sitting at the back. You can see our digital switching in here. And you might notice we've got Wago fuses and Wago blocks. Very easy to install, much more compact than we had before. And we've got uh, three of the 4,800 batteries. So that means these batteries are the equivalent to four, uh, 400 amp hours at 12 volt each. And we've got three of those, but that's not what's special on this kit. We've got a 240 volt inverter and a 120 volt inverter charger. Um, now the 240 volt inverter is there to run the uh, Safari uh, hot water system and the double induction. The 120 is running all the GPOs and all the other outlets that they have um, over there in uh, Taiwan. Scotty is sitting just behind a, a, a post in here. That's where it's gonna be sitting. So we've laid this out as if it's literally sitting inside the vehicle. And something new that we're doing now is the way that we're doing this uh, box structure here, bolting onto the side of the batteries here to hold it up, bolting in here to do our double layer uh, that you can see. And that's going to be an incredibly compact um, setup. It's all within this line here, which is the area that we've got in the crafter. Stops here, and this board sits here. This is in the rear garage. That's all under the seat. This is a total here of 6,000 watts of inverter and inverter charger and 1,200 amp hours of lithium. Scotty running at 3,000 watts there and all the digital switching, uh, TPMS and also the uh, auto off on the uh, lights at night. And I've got to say, how good's that?